Hey guys, how you doing? Uh, welcome to my channel. I'm Andres Kindred. Uh, please give this video a like, subscribe, and let me share with you my latest update on what's been happening this past couple of days with my account. As, as you might have uh, noticed, I did a video yesterday um, and uh, my blog got hacked, right? And uh, it's, it's been a long story, right? Uh, it was down. It, it was down a couple of days ago, but that was because of a different reason. I had a uh, that uh, 500. I think I did this video here. This uh, HTTP. The HTTP HTTP error 500, right? So when I typed in my my blog, um. So that was a different issue. So I talked about that. I had to go and fix some links that I transferred from my blogger. So I fixed that. I did a kind of to give you a, in a nutshell. I was chatting with some Google representatives, and I thought I was dealing with the Google domain department, but it was actually the issue with with the Google Search Console. It's a total different department. So I I learned about that. You know, so that's. Uh, that was good <laughs> that I know those are two separate things, you know. Uh, so, so a lot of learning experience. That's why I'm doing these videos, guys, as I'm going through this, uh, I'm learning myself. Uh, but I'm telling you, I've been in chats on the phone yesterday and today. And I'm not going to lie to you, it's been a little bit exhausting just being on the computer for, for that long. And I haven't been sleeping. <laughs> been sleeping like five hours a day. So, I mean, I'm not complaining. I'm saying... I want to give you some strength and uh, to tell you that even this might might have been the most technical challenge I've had so far and you know my blog got hacked you know so it's uh, you know it's, uh, first of all when you type in your blog and then then it doesn't come along it doesn't you put in your your domain and then it's broken it's like that's not a bad that's about it's not a good feeling right but then once you actually find out that your blog got hacked that's not fun at all guys it's uh, really what I felt was really it's almost like if someone ever hacked into your bank account or something like that but it's not as bad right because that, that would have been like thank god I've never had that happen and I do keep all the protections I, I am all set with that in that sense I take that super serious you know I do have all the security tools and it's, my bank is awesome and you know but with the blog, I didn't really think it was that big of a deal. Like, I just kind of like, oh, I'm going to open my blog and I'm going to start writing. But I didn't really think of, like, someone hacking your blog. That's It's like someone hacking your YouTube channel, right? Or uh, I mean, I've heard, like, some social medias get hacked sometimes. Like, they you hack your Facebook. Or, but, uh, but I just didn't have thought. Like, it never even came to mind. Like, someone's going to hack my blog. Like, we're just... Uh, kind of funny now but so let, let me share with you what happened guys so so i so so if you saw my video right i i i had my blog got hacked so i called in uh, uh so just to explain you guys again how this works you, you got your your wordpress right you got your 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 blog right so this is this is um by the way uh just before i show you my page i kind of wanted to give you a disclaimer here I did edit my as soon as soon as this happened. I edit my title, just in case because I, I have like a solo ad going on right now. That means uh, if you don't know what solo ads are, it's like I send an offer for like emails because I'm trying to promote a sale, right? And all these people are probably gonna look me up and gonna check my my blog, you know. So this happened. This is crazy. It just happened. Perfect timing, right, for this whole thing. I did put in a, I'm just going to show you right now, I'm going to go to my blog, uh, let's go visit sites, this is going to be a good video guys, you're going to get a lot out of this one, uh, so check it out, how to be a successful affiliate marketer, right, that's my title, oh, sorry guys, <laughs> so, uh, I'm going to make this bigger a little bit, alright, and then I put in, guys, my blog got hacked, Disregard the non-related content, working with my team to fix this. You know, it's like at least they're going to be, you know, checking out my affiliate market stuff, the 10x book by Grant Cardone, you know, 
top affiliate marketing websites and then all of a sudden like so what happened is like if you follow my my video before uh i had all someone was like posting all these blogs on my my blog on my blog right and it's like it's not a good feeling it's like who's doing that you know this is so so i called yesterday I had to put in some security into my blogger, into my blog. Sorry, I keep calling it blogger because I used to have blogger before. So I keep saying blogger. I got to say WordPress. Um, my WordPress, WordPress guy. Uh, WordPress.org, not .com. Make sure you get the word, the right WordPress because that's going to be a pain, a pain in the butt for you guys to to transfer it. I've heard stories of people that started with WordPress.com and because they thought it's the same company because it's WordPress. But it's they're different guys. It's so a WordPress.com and WordPress.org. So I'm using WordPress.org, and that's what the Antra community recommends. Uh, my teacher. So sure you get WordPress.org. So what happens is like you you gotta get a hosting company, right? So my hosting company is called GoDaddy, and what they do for you is that your blog is powered by a big computer like a big powerful computer right so that's what GoDaddy is so they my blog is kind of like it, it's embedded I don't know how to describe it but it's, it's inside this big computer right and they manage the whole thing but my blog is my responsibility right so how safe I keep my blog it's like when you have like a, a computer right you can have the best computer but you got to have some antivirus right you got to take care of your protection so yesterday I called in and I talked to this awesome dude from GoDaddy. He helped me out. So I said I put in like some, I had to pay like 180 bucks for the whole year, guys. So it's an expense that you have to do, but I'm going to be able to write it down when I do my taxes next year because I'm going to, now I have my online business. So that's a great thing. All these tools that you spend money on, just know that you can write them down for, for your taxes, you know? So 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 what happens like you know he, i put the security thing so i got this plug in now um which is like a security I'm, I'm all set right and um but then they told me yesterday okay we we got this we, you're all set you got this thing going on the security thing but we have to run a scan and we're going to be sending you emails in the next 12 hours this was like yesterday night so this was it's wednesday today it's around four p.m. right now it was yesterday night around 9 p.m. or 8 p.m. or something and they're open 24 hours so you can chat with them or you know they're great great people the guy knew a lot uh, he explained me what happens is like you know it your website is just like a website when you open it is very vulnerable and people are gonna try to attack it and do things and if you don't have any protection so that's why you should have some sort of so we recommend this one it's called Firefox so I installed it, it's all set, they ran the scan, but it's still gonna take 12 hours, right? So in this 12 hours, what I'm doing is like, I'm keeping an eye on my blog. So every time I see like a new post, I delete it, right? And then a couple of hours go by, I go to bed, then I wake up, nothing happened actually. And then a couple of hours later again. So actually just a couple of, I'm like, okay, I cannot wait these 12 hours and I'm not going to wait until this whole scam process gets finalized. I, I, I got to talk to someone right now. I just, it's just like driving me crazy. Like seeing this, like persons having access to my account. Right. So I go in the chat cause I already told on the phone. So I'm going to call them again, but they do have a chat. So I start chatting with this guy and they walk me through and, and you go to your, and I'm pretty sure uh, the other one they talk about is like blue host, which, um, I've heard really good things about Bluehost also, but I, I like GoDaddy. And, you know, it's, they're being, their their customer service has been amazing. Uh, the chat is super responsive. So I'm chatting with this person, and he looks at me too. He's like, "Oh, I see what's going on. You got your scan. It's running." And I tell him, "You know, I I I I I told the guy I actually changed my password for my." Check it out. So you got to think of this. You got your blogger, your, your, sorry, not your blogger, your WordPress blog. It's powered by GoDaddy, right? So it's, they work together, right? It's like, think of it as like when you have ClickFunnels on Aweber, which is your, going to be your email, email marketing tool. And then you have your ClickFunnels, which is your, you know, remember Aweber, um, 
that's where you're going to do your campaigns and all that right um so this is mine right here um you know for example so you're going to be using this this thing here it's called a weber and you use it with your click funnels right so it's kind of like the same concept of like this you got to have these two tools and they kind of work together right it's like two separate companies but you got to manage these two are connected there's an integration between these two this is how you're going to send the emails to your customers and then this is going to you're going to create your sales funnels right so it's kind of like the same with GoDaddy and WordPress, right? They, these two or whatever hosting you can have, uh, Bluehost or the GoDaddy, they are going to be connected. So my my thing is like I didn't change my password for GoDaddy. So this hacker somehow, because I didn't have my protection, was able to hack into my how whatever they did, you know. So he told me, okay, I'm going to send you some links right now in the chat and you're going to change your password. And we did it like three times, guys. This was like a, this was like a sting operation we did here. So he told me, okay, send the link, ready? Boom, do this. Then next time, want another link? Let's change it again. Boom. And did both on both accounts. Then it's like, it's all set. This was a couple of hours ago. I don't see any new postings yet. So. I think, and you know what, this is going to end up working. I'm going to be totally protected. No more hacking is going to be able to happen. I didn't have any protection, guys, so I was very vulnerable. It's going to happen. So if you don't have your blog area and you haven't gotten started, please do yourself a favor and you don't have to go through what I'm going right now because it's a really, it's a, it's a bad feeling, guys. I've been, it just kind of affected me emotionally a little bit, like, you know, I was like, no, it's not the end of the world, but I'm like, okay, I'm running a solo ad right now. I'm trying to get people to buy my offer, right? And then they're going to be seeing this stuff on, on, on my on my blog, right? They're going to put my domain and it's like they're going to see all this crap, right? I do have, I do have, um, I wanted to show it because I still have those, uh, let me, let me show you. I still have them on the trash. So I didn't want to delete them because I'm like, I want to tell you about, this video so that's all said we I fixed the security issues so it should be all good now I have my tool it's monitoring that thing 24 hours I got the plugins it tells me who's signing in all the IP addresses I can actually I know actually the IP addresses where this happened so um, it's a great great tool um, you know I just don't understand why people do this stuff it's like what was the purpose of like hacking into someone's blog it's like it's, you know, I feel bad for these people. Like they just don't have a purpose in life. You know, I'm like talking about uh, Grant Cardone's like 10x rule book and like how you gotta have a vision when you become a millionaire, how you're gonna help the world and donate for causes. I'm like, I got this in my mind now being part of Antra and you know, my mentors and like Jeff, you know, Jeff Lerner and all these teachings in the Antra community. So it's like my level of thinking is like now it's like somewhere else, right? I'm have this goal to have all these goals. And now this happens and it makes me think like, what is these people doing? You know, like what is their reasoning behind it? Like, is it for fun? Like they want to think it's like, did there, I don't know, but it's just like, I feel bad for them because they really don't don't have like a mission like they're not contributing to anything I, I don't mean to go too much in that topic but it's kind of like the whole point is like guys security take it serious on your blog <laughs> even though your blog can get hacked you know so um make sure you start the right way you know so you don't have to go through this but i do let, let me show you guys um so I'm going to keep this just, just, I'm just going to keep it there for a few more hours. I'm going to get rid of that just in case they still are able to post something. I see they haven't, nothing's been posted and they were doing it quite often. So I know there should have been a new one by now, but this, this is ridiculous guys. Like check, check this out. Um, show you something. Um, uh, so I'm still trying to navigate through this. Oh, okay, so you go to posts, 
then you go to all your posts and you go to trash over here 42 items in the trash in the past couple of days guys like seriously guys like you just posted 42 i can't believe i deleted that many already i was doing it as fast as possible I'm like keeping an eye on my blog right 42 items on my blog guys so check them out still have them before i get rid of them but i wanted to show you let's check this out okay one doesn't sound too bad right i'm not gonna restore it because it's gonna polish it so i don't want any of this so i don't even want to go through the content because this is like garbage and bull crap that's what it is but okay what well, connections with global firms kind of sounds good right it could be a good blog i guess but uh the huge benefits of tina mail by bright some mattress stuff best hookup sites um whenever the dominican and malogran ricken girls in new york nowadays whatever finest dating websites look at this like free vietnamese internet dating websites vietnamese public producing filipina just like this is something I'm just it's kind of funny now guys i just gotta laugh at this stuff like but i i can't believe this has actually happened uh it just keeps going man um the slavic women you know and uh, let's go to let's go to the next page and see what we got here where to get matched through online community forums the actual nectar comfort set so popular getting foreign wedding brides for sale that's dominican women my personal perfect russian wife it's just like man i i just it's just ridiculous i can't believe this stuff and and you know some of them are kind of repeated right so it's like some video games range from motion downloads i guess this is not on that topic but they did uh and if you see let's check out the time so this one's happened all at the same time 12 12 12 12 12 a.m yesterday all right let's check the third page just want to share this with you okay so it's only two more yeah all at 12 from yesterday and then today Right, this was just yesterday okay now this one actually hello world that was actually me that i did a little drop that i was doing a video so this is this regard this one let's say 20 this was uh one that i that's actually my one legit one in the trash so it was just like a little draft that i didn't do anything on it but they are all 12 and then 11 26 a.m today was the latest one so so yeah, guys, it, it's they, they posted all this stuff, you know, and uh, that was a new one that got while they were fixing. So I guess just running that scan helped a lot stop because they were going pretty fast, right? And again, I haven't seen any new ones, so we'll keep you up, updated if uh, if they do come out. But I do wanted to share this with you guys, and and uh, it's gonna be all good, man. So let's you know, my my blog is is back and running. I always protect it. Um, I do have my title there just in case. I'm going to just leave it a couple of hours. I just want to kind of triple check. I'm that kind of guy that likes to triple check everything, you know. Um, but uh, the main takeaway, guys, is that um, just take your blog seriously uh, because uh, it's going to be vulnerable, especially when you're starting, you know. So uh, I, can, I feel a lot better now, I'm telling you. I, I've been... Um, having a couple of rough couple of uh, days you know uh, just two just two days you know but it just kind of took away from my from what i've been doing it was like it just kind of distracted me a little bit but at the same time i learned a lot and it was a great experience to to actually chat with uh, the google people and the the, the, the GoDaddy people send emails and it just kind of it's a growing it's a learning experience you know and so whatever technical issues you might run into if you have any questions, just let me know. You can leave a comment below, and I will point you to the right direction. I might have I've gone through a lot of more other things, but this was kind of pretty much the biggest one so far, you know. 
And so it was a challenge, you know, but things like you overcome it, you fix the problem. It wasn't an easy chat, you know, so I, told you I had to chat a bunch of times, like wait, I have to do phone calls and then I have to keep monitoring my thing and I got a lot going on. Um, but uh, it's all good now, guys. So just uh, very happy and I want to share this content with you and uh, thanks again for being here. Please subscribe, leave a comment, guys. I really would love to engage with you and see uh, if you have any questions or anything, let me know. And awesome. So have a nice uh, day and stay safe and keep your accounts and your blog safe because uh, you can just get uh, an antivirus. Just talk to your hosting company and they'll be the best to advise on that. Uh, don't be afraid to chat with these guys. They're awesome. Uh, all of them have been really nice, you know. So if someone ever tells you that uh, they're not that nice or that Google people never get back to you or stuff like that, it's not true. I, say, they, I was in the chats with them and they were super friendly and uh, very knowledgeable so uh, all right guys so thank you again uh you just needed to this video feels so good just doing this live as i'm emotionally going through this uh, in the real moment right now so uh it's going to be a value i'm sure i'll look back into this in a couple of months and I'm glad i did it you know all right guys so have an awesome day i don't want to go but uh we'll kids stay here all day talking but i gotta get going now all right guys take care have a nice day